So as you can see, DJ arrived yesterday evening. Yes, but you will still see some of the solo Lisa videos for the rest of the week. Our buffer period for videos. But yeah, DJ is back after what 12 days apart. Lisa was so somewhat. Happy to see them when they arrived, but yeah. It's basically, we are not outside because I don't know, if, let's see. It's raining quite heavily, so we are in. So what's new so last Friday new ordinance governmental ordinance came in force up until Friday you could hang out with six members six people all together you know well five other people and you so six people all together could hang out but since Friday only family members or people living together basically only people living together can be together and one family member can let's say visit you but from today there for basically next two weeks all the non-essential non-essential um, stores will be closed so only food stores can be open and they said basically they put in some quite ridiculous um, let's say ordinance that these shops cannot sell non-food items so basically you know you have like this um, large large supermarkets and of course they you know beside the food they also sell you know clothes cosmetics and so forth and now a lot of these things cannot be sold so they had to remove it or i don't know what will they do i'll just you know close some people well in some stores can they can close mm -hmm. some of these aisles completely or these displays plus what's in um, so there are more strict regulations regarding crossing the border um, they also yeah they also shut down all the public transport so no buses no bus service the only i don't know but what about trains i think they most likely they also shut them yeah no as you can see she wants to all the pets all the deep tissue massage she almost done with the hair loss with hair removal almost so yeah, bus are, buses are closed, the only buses that can be running are so-called, you know, Lisa! And she said enough. TJ is upset, well, confused. But yeah, this is Snow Wolf. Too hot inside. So she has to go outside. So yeah, now the only buses that can go around are so called you know um, uh, workers buses basically you know employee which, which has which has a lot of uh, uh, workers uh, set up you know their own bus schedule bus route to pick along you know different settlements towns cities whatever 
their workers and bring them um, bring them to factory or whatever so they and also taxis taxis are also allowed but all the others shut down so yeah for next two weeks basically they are trying to stop this um, spreading so just after I posted um, last week's update on Monday they announced that the R number so the R number is basically regeneration of virus has fallen under one which means one people that is infected with the virus um, infects less than one other people person but yeah then in the but the infection rate is still too high so we our record number is 32 percent but currently we are between 25 and 30 percent per day so yesterday so on sunday's results are sunday's results are 28 percent infection uh 28 percent of tests were positive so still a very high number and last week we also reached a new record regarding deaths so the i think it was in wednesday that we had uh, 40 deaths and then the next day we had the new record 41 deaths so yeah the number of deaths is rising even faster than the rate of uh, the rate of infected i think that yeah in the last week we had the same even larger amount of deaths as in the whole first wave of this thing so yeah, it's important to stay isolated, not going out as much, only when they dis these two need walking, but yeah, otherwise staying. Yeah, Gigi decided that his bed is not as soft as Lisa's bed, so now he's taking over this bed because it's apparently much softer than his uh, what else is new huh, last week uh, um, I also met with uh, owner of Jerry the German Shepherd friend of Lisa's and he told me that he's doing well he got injured and basically he was at the doctor at the vets and they cannot figure out what's wrong basically he's limping on his uh one of the i think he's i don't know one of his uh back legs hind legs most likely he um he was you know running around uh, chasing the ball or playing around and stepped in a hole or some you know imperfection in the grass or whatever and on the ground and he injured his joint or muscle or what but the doctor the doctor the vet cannot say for sure what kind of injury is so currently he's just get, getting antibiotics if if it's you know a small tear that can heal it on its own but yeah ct will be needed to figure out if it's a major if it's a major tear and then of course they will have to operate on it 
because it will not heal on itself and last week we also met with a um, lady so the Alaskan melon with puppy which we also uh, she was also shown in one of the previous videos and she has a similar injury but this this is going on she said almost for a month now and she's limping on her f um, front right foot paw and she was at several vets and basically the same thing um, ran um, x-ray didn't show anything strange except that uh, the vet thought that perhaps um, there is some slight asymmetry between her uh, left and right leg and he said perhaps that the right leg at the joint has been growing a little bit differently than the left leg and the, perhaps there is a small you know couple of millimeters bump that isn't on the left leg and that is now affecting her walking because she said uh, the owner said basically she will walk for a couple you know 10 meters and then she will just lay down and she can you know she's visibly visibly lim uh, limping and of course now they are also waiting to get the CT because um, you know soft tissue to see if they will see if they, there is any you know tear on the ligament or anything else but the other possibility is also you know bone cancer so yeah hopefully nothing serious it is with both of them but there is you know some just minor injury but yeah and yeah apparently currently there is you know a lot of um, there is a lot of uh, waiting for uh, vet appointments which is quite quite surprisingly because usually I got you know in a couple of days now they are waiting for two weeks or so I don't know what is going on but a lot of people well pets need currently vet attention yeah. DJ is doing okay still walking still wanted to go outside still eating but yeah slowing down so yeah that's pretty much all from Ljubljana regarding last week and yeah stay home stay healthy don't meet don't mingle with other people and just try to survive this pandemic physically and mentally healthy so we will see you next time bye